Hey guys, it's um, Xbron Tech, and today I'll be showing you smart screen for the iPad. It's a uh, $7 in the City S store. Uh, there's no cracked version out yet, so I can't get it for free, but I bought it, so I thought I'd show it to you. So it's you can pretty much add widgets to your lock screen. So as you can see, it has all these widgets, calendar, the shortcuts, stuff like that. Um, then if you double tap the home button, it brings up this, where it just shows your battery and yeah, music controls, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, 3G. But and then if you, I'll show you where you can get it. You go go into Cydia, add that media phone repository, the top. Add that. I'll put the link in the description of what you add, and then you go to it, and then here's all the widgets right there. Smart screen for the iPad. You can get the light version and try it out, see how you like it. But as you can see, it has all these different types of widgets. Okay, uh, settings for it are this app. As you can see, I have all the weather, calendar, clock, dev team, like news feed, so it tracks the dev team's blog, mail, notes, quick launch, search bar, and calculator. Um, you can go into each one, and it just gives you different options for each. You can preview the app see how it looks and then you have settings down here at the bottom for a smart screen you can enable it disable it just all these different settings and you have about and then so as you can see you can hold if you hold down on a widget let's see if I can get one there it wiggles like this and you can drag it around and you can make different pages of widgets so you can scroll through like that and you can just stick it pretty much anywhere you want on that and then it works in landscape mode and yeah it's pretty much it calendar you can switch dates if you have something going on. Newsfeed search. You can search right there. Google, Yahoo, Bing, or Twitter. So like Bing, Yahoo, Twitter. You can just search that. And then you just hit the X. Slide down the keyboard. Goes away. But uh, yeah, calculator right here. Notes. Tap that to make a new note if you want. But yeah, I'd recommend it. It helps. You can see data on here. You don't have to go to like a different. You don't have to unlock it and check. So like the shortcuts, if you want to check, say like your email, you just tap that, and then it launches your mail. So I'd recommend it. Thanks for watching. Um, comment, like, and subscribe.